getting things ready for you as I drop something on my foot. Okay, hold on. I'm coming. I'm coming. Dropped it again. Mother crapper. Okay, I need to um, put this on. And I don't know where that just went, so I'll do it again. I have no idea. Oh, there it is, way over there. Okay. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome. Hope you're having a blessed day and a good day. This thing seems to be in my way. What's up, hammer? Called the hammer today. We are going to look at the August Monster Bass box. What's up, Jonathan? And I'm going to show you just a teeny clip of yesterday's fishing trip with Captain Philip Wilds. And it is, it's just an underwater picture of some small mahi-mahi. It's kind of cool. I mean, it's something probably you haven't seen, but it's a group of fish while we were getting bait that just came, seemed to, that came through and, and we broke out the light tackle and just crushed them and released every one of them. Um, so I'll show you that at the end, just as a video. So we have that uh, Mangrove Madness video coming soon. Not sure when. Um, you know, there's a lot of things. There's just so many things that trying to get done and that kind of stuff. So, but we, today we're going to talk about monster bass. We'll talk about that, and then we're really close to getting to that. 3,000, which will be a milestone for us, and we are going to give one subscriber a pair of Costa sunglasses. So if you're not a subscriber, click that subscribe button on YouTube, youtube.com slash Fishing Florida Radio. Subscribe, be part of the, the family, and uh, sign up for the prize packs and that kind of stuff. Hey, Jason, I hope you're doing well. So let's look at Monster Bass. Okay, I am opening it. Jeez. Okay, well, first look, I can tell you this box has a, is very full. Very, very full. And if you don't know Monster Bass, Monster Bass is, this is their fourth month, and their kind of specialty is that they go to um, they say they're going to give you seven or eight quality products in each box. And I think each box, I told you I was sunburned yesterday. Look at me. Mike, what's up, Robert and Joe? So they give you seven or eight things inside of one box and name products, not junk. And so that's what they're, they're claim to fame is. So this month they have, uh, they have a monster bass challenge. You can win a hundred bucks. Oh, and here we go. They actually tell you, wow, there's a lot of money in this month's uh, tackle box. Wow, I must be missing something. Well, at least they give us, they always give you some stickers. I love that, but sorry. And if you want, you can save $10. There's my thing, store 10. You can use it. So we'll start off real easy. Uh, I think it's about $34 for this one. $34.95. Oh, let me just, another thing. Some, mm, some nice person emailed me about how they thought I had, uh, I was part of what Monster Bass does. Now, while I do think that I could help them in the Florida market, they have not asked me. Hey, Butch. Hammer, Mike, David, everybody. I'll try to add you to the broadcast. Says, oh, my gosh. Look how big that showed up, Butch. Butch, you're super sized, dude. And quite honestly, I really don't know how to shrink you. Any, oh, maybe I do right here. Oh, no, that doesn't shrink you. Hold on. We're going to try to figure this out real fast. Oh, there we go. I'm shrinking you now, Butch. I'll put these right here if I can get to them. Anyway. So I have no affiliation with these guys. I have haven't met them. I've got a phone call from them when I my first box. 
And I did give away a couple boxes on the radio. We did on the radio show, but we did it a different way. But we have no affiliation. They do not pay me or ask for any of my help. However, I do think I could help them. I'm just, I'm just saying. There you go. Which was big. So start us off. They've got us with uh, some ultra lock mustat four out hooks. You always can use hooks. Uh, as you know, I am a Daiichi person, so I'm not going to really knock this one, but I use only Daiichi hooks. Take it for whatever it's worth. They're the world's sharpest. They do a lot for everybody, so I'm a Daiichi fan. But doesn't mean I don't like getting hooks. These are four-aught four hooks uh, for soft plastics, three of them. I mean, I, I'm not going to I'm not gonna joke. Good morning. Good afternoon, Matt. I'm really, really surprised by this. This this is pretty ridiculous. I want to pick through some things and build up some suspense. So, they gave a pack. And by the way, they're full packs. This one is a Big Bite Baits. This is the 4-inch, oh, Dean Rojas Frog. Fighting Frog in Green Pumpkin. And it's a whole pack. Does it smell? Oh, they're sealed, so I can't open them. But not bad. Something I would use. Oh, let me put that one up. There's my little sister. Hey, Lynn. So, yes. Big bite baits. Not bad. Something I'd use. I like that. Next. Wow. You guys are going to be shocked on what's in this box. I am... I am... Okay, I'll get to it. Uh, they gave us some uh, yum... Six inch sharpshooter whole pack. These are worms. Of course, they're in green. Everyone likes pumpkin. Everyone likes that color. Ooh! Almost broke that thing off. So, yes, another full pack. I don't know where to go from here. Um, well, we'll start here. A doomsday frog. You've never used this. These ones you put your own hooks in. These are actually pretty nice. This is actually a, a, a frog that you can use almost you can use almost anywhere. Um, but a great bait, great bait, and that bait costs. That's a, a six dollar bait. So that's I mean the yum was about three bucks. The big bites were five bucks. So we got like fourteen dollars into three items so far, and three items I'd use. That's the key. Next, I, I'm I'm really I'm really shocked. Another one, but this is a theirs. It is a top water, and another thing I'd use. I wouldn't use it for freshwater fishing, but I'll use it for saltwater fishing for sure. Top water monster bass bait. Why is uh, pumpkin such a, a good one? That's a really good question. You want to know what? I'll ask somebody about that. There you go. Uh, monster bass. I like this. This is a new kind of thing. This is probably a topwater walking bait. So you can walk the dog. But that's a nice little... Let's Hold on. Oh, it's got a little bit of rattle. You want to know what I think green... Why everyone... Everyone likes green pumpkin. It's, it's something that... If you don't know the reason why bass target worms is that's when they're small that's what they're their first thing that they eat a majority of so then when they get bigger they still continue to feast on those if they can find them so it's like a kind of like a it's almost like uh when you go fishing with a a lizard a lizard is one of bass's main forage here in florida and they hate them so a lot of times, even if they're not hungry, they'll go after a lizard just to get it out of their area. Anyway, monster bass. Good looking bait. Look at that. This new crackling thing is the in thing to do. Not a bad looking bait. Probably walks the dog real well. Looks like it's got some good hooks. It's a top water, three fourths of an ounce. Not bad. Not bad. Next. What is this? A Lunker Hunt Yappa Bug. Now, I've never used this, but you want to know what it looks like. Sorry for the reflection. Hold on, let me get this off the thing because people are texting nonstop. Uh, and I'm sorry I'm not putting everybody else. 
green is money. Yeah, Matt's dead on it. This is a top water like a wake bait. They call it the Yappa Bug from Lunker Hunt. This is something I wanted to test out and try, so now I don't have to even worry about that. Good looking. It's like a uh, cicada kind of thing, but uh, it's really the action of the bug that's going to be what attacks this. So another lure that I'm pretty happy about, and that is a well, that's a soft plastic lure. Next, a bomber. What do they call this? The long A. And the Palmer Long A is a series of long, uh, has long been the number one choice among avid anglers. True running and tough. I guess it's just a little swim bait. Stick swim bait. Not bad. In a good color, too. <laughs> not bad. And then last but not least... Boom goes the dynamite. A savage gear. Is this plastic? It is plastic. What is this thing? A savage gear, slow sinking. Uh, bluegill. Look at that thing. 3D, cool looking. Hook up here, hook down here. My gosh. Look at this. I'm just going to show you everything. So it's a jerk bait. Thank you, Jonathan. Let me just add Jonathan to the list. Thank you, Jonathan. Classic jerk bait. Don't know my own crap. So you got those two lures. You got the frog. I actually have, I should say, I have a couple of these. I have like more than a couple. I think I have like five or six. I, I, I've used these. They're kind of one of those things I tried, I haven't talked about. Uh, Anyway, I like the guys from Doomsday Tackle. So we got that. We got the 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 top water bait. We got the Yappa Bug. We got the Yums. I can't even hold all of it. And we got the Big Bite Baits and the hooks. Look at that. That is what's in this month's Monster Bass box. That's crazy. That's the best box I've ever seen. That's the truth. I like this. I like this frog. I like this frog. Make sure there's nothing else. I like the frog. I don't use these. Oh, good rattle to them, too. Exactly. Ow. Matt said it. That's a sexy box. I need to sign up. They are, the box is $34.95 a month. But this is the best box I've ever seen in my life. So you got the stick bait. You got the Yappa. Oh, the box opened. The Yappa thing. I'm not putting it in the box. I'm using this and killing, killing fish with this. Killing fish with this. Trout. Sea trout. Oh, man. They love this kind of stuff. The hooks. It's just a preference. I like these. I like these. Shut the door. So, let me add you. Max, Max says sexy box right there. Need to get this. And it's, it's true. It's true. So, they gave us a price for everything. So, they have, uh, so 14, they're saying that the retail price of all this is 14, 20, 29. Hold on. 10, 24, 30, 39, uh, 47, 56 dollars worth of stuff in this month's monster box, monster bass box. Thumbs up. That's the best box I've ever seen. That's the God's honest truth. That's the best box I've ever seen. Again, I have no affiliation with these guys. I do think what they're doing is the right thing. Um, they like to listen. They send out a lot of a lot of things saying what what how do how do you like this? What do you think of this? Um, so David says I have a friend that uses uh, the brim, and he catches a lot of big bass on it. M me too, David, and welcome to the channel. Unbelievable! That's a great box. 
Monster Bass. Thank you. Thank you. Not that I've been disappointed with them in the in the last the first three months. I've had some issues with some of the stuff, um, but only because they've sent some deep water stuff that just isn't usable here in where I go fishing. That has nothing to do with because they can't make a box specific for me. I realize that. I, I'm not. I don't. I don't think they should make a box specific for me. I mean, if they want to, they can, but. Um, they don't and they try to get take a group of people and just generalize it and just do it that way did you notice how the the light turned lighter when i got did that i wonder why it would. anyway um and and the other thing is is they i've stated my opinion and it's just my opinion no don't take any offense to it the the pro staff that you guys have on there they don't need to comment when they don't when they disagree with me that they don't have to do that we have our opinion, and that's it. I'm just going to tell it how it is. I'm going to shoot it straight. That's what, that's all we have on this radio show and this thing that we do here. So, you know, the radio show is Saturday morning, 6 to 9 a.m. I welcome anyone from Monster Bass to call in and tell us. They're welcome to call in and promote. It's free. Um, but anyway, we're going to give away a pair of Costa sunglasses, and not just a pair that I have. You're going to get a card with a, 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 re, a redemption code. You can go on the Costa Sunglasses and Costa Del Mar and you can pick out any pair, any lens, anything, as much as they want. It's one pair. It, as a, You pick it out and you'll get it a couple few days later. So we have that. At When we hit 3,000 subscribers, I'm going to pick a person out of there randomly. I'm going to put up a post saying, hey guys, Thanks for watching. Here's we're at three thousand. Send a comment, and you could win these sunglasses. And whoever comments will have the chance to win. Yeah. Well, I mean, honestly, yeah, the the stuff that I get for deep water, I I actually, to be honest, Charles. And thanks for watching. I I send it to to fans of the radio show. And you guys got to remember, we have those prize packs. If you want some free tackle from the radio show, all you got to do is. Go to our, our our Facebook this Facebook page and private messages and just say hey watch the video Steve told me to ask for some prize packs and send your address or if you feel like it's easier you can email us I'll put my email up there ooh maybe he hopefully you didn't see that email at info at fishingfloridaradio.com so very good question very good question Jason so truth be told. Um, I think the only time I've got yelled at would be from that blessed animated lure. And I probably shouldn't showed her the video uh, because she didn't like that I took a hammer to it. So, um, and you can hear yelling at the dog actually right now. So I probably got in trouble by that. It It's surprising. We do this radio show. We do get a lot of a lot of things see you later joe we do we do pick up a lot of stuff we do have sponsors i should tell i should say that so like hold on so i have all these rods to test out there's only a few i think i got 22 or so hold on So we do get some stuff, and uh, there's there's the real question. See, see, this is this Mike is part of the radio show. Did we get in trouble yesterday because we got burned? Yes, Mike, you got burned more than I do. I should say that. So I didn't get. I mean, I don't know. If, did Sonia say something to you? I I was wondering. Uh, Mike's like Captain Mike's like tackle webs, and he's part of the show. He's He's the, the sex appeal, as we call it at the show, uh, because he's got this great beard, and he's just unbelievable, and he's just the best dude in the whole world. He's like one of my closest friends, but we get stuff all the time. Some of the stuff you see me do reviews on, and we like it, and yes, Arby's, Arby's yesterday was killing us, and then some of the stuff you probably would never know that I got. Uh, I have, you know, I've got stuff that I'm testing right now. 
These are the new uh, Hula Popper 2s. You'll see a review on those soon. But you can see, if you hear me throw it over there, that usually might not be a good, a good thing. The new Live Target Erratic Shiners. Two different sizes. And the new Jordan Lee Baits. Someone's getting these, though, because I will not be using them. So I'm going to give them to somebody. Two different colors. So there's there's stuff that we get, and then some of it, some of it, a lot of it goes to kids. I, I'm really big about making sure I give it to the, the Boy Scouts Club here in uh, where I live and here in Apopka. So I donate it to anybody. We do a gumbo cook-off every year here, here in October, and we brought out hundreds of packs of lures last year for any of the kids that can that uh, came to it. So uh, there, can you be a tester? There's many ways to be a tester. Um, you just, I mean, it helps that we've had a 12-year radio show. You know, hey, John. Uh, so that, that, that kind of helps the whole situation. So, okay. We, Mike and I went fishing yesterday with Captain Philip Wilds of, I don't even, I don't know Captain Philip Wilds' website right off the top of my head, but he absolutely is hands down one of the top two guides I've ever went fishing with. He has a game plan, he sets it in motion, he tells you what it is, and, and he gets fish. He catches fish. So, I'm in the process of editing. A video that we're gonna I'm gonna call Mangrove Madness Madness. Now we're gonna it's probably gonna be in two parts. But I thought it'd be really cool to show you some of the underwater footage of some Mahi that we ran into. Mike was busy catching bait because he's a captain, he knows the rules. And and when that happens, I decided I was going to uh, light tackle fish for small dolphin that were like four, 10, 12, 14 inches. They weren't real big. We didn't keep them. We just hooked them on light tackle, and they just have an amazing fight, and they jump three foot in the air. They're like little tarpon, but it was so much fun. Anyway, I wanted to show you some footage, just a small clip of what we dealt with yesterday for six hours. Every place we stopped, we were in, if we didn't have a bait in the water, every two and a half to three minutes we caught a fish for six hours go to another spot two out two minutes later you're fish on and i'm not talking like you'll see these these peanut mahi these are small but we caught bonita at this place we caught triple tail we caught uh mahi we caught red snapper mangrove snapper triple tail eight amberjacks we caught like 10 different species of fish and it was absolutely crazy. But we put the drone up, so we got some drone footage. But we did some really first-time underwater footage. And I thought I'd give you a little taste of it. So here's what it looked like. Let's see. Resume last video. Oh, there we Hold on. That is the some of the school of mahi that we were that surrounded the boat, and as you can see, they're just little small peanuts, but you can see them all over. And we we got them, we surrounded them, and we just threw bait after bait, and it was just stupid fun. On like crazy, not super light tackle, but you know that light tackle ish, and man, it was just awesome. So. Uh, I'll do give it to you one more time. Now I slowed this down so you could see it a lot better because they did swim real fast. But look at the school of mahi mahi there, and they ate everything that was around them. We've got some bite, uh, some video of underwater bites of amberjack and all sorts of other stuff. So it's, I think. We've got a winner on our hands for this video. Now, let me just state, we I shot 
because uh, Mike did Mike's a fantastic angler. I mean, he's a captain. I mean, it's unbelievable. But I filmed Mike catching. I don't even know how many fish. Maybe twenty five or thirty fish. We got underwater footage. We got drone footage. To be quite honest, yeah, that we should have had a fly rod. You're right. I want to go out there and put it on a fly rod. Uh, by the way, let me put that back on there. Um, it might take me a little bit longer to edit this video because I think, uh, hey Jack, I think I filmed three or four hours of stuff. And, you know, I fished, Mike fished, and it was unbelievable. I was actually going to do a cook and catch and show, show you some of the snapper that we brought home. We brought home a ton of snapper, and we kept one amberjack, and we just, it was one of those days that it was unbelievable. It, to be quite honest, I've been out with, with Phil Wilds twice. Both times has been ridiculous fishing. I mean, I, we went one time, amberjack covered the back of the boat the whole back of the boat looked like something had bled there was that much red on top of the water he brings these fish up to you so you don't really have to do anything you just got to get a bait in the water if you can't get a bait in the water fast enough something's wrong with you right mike i mean he yells at you he's like look get the bait in the water um but again that uh, that's just one of many Many, many underwater film stuff, that, underwater filming we, I did. So you're going to see that hopefully soon. Those are just little dolphins, but it was really cool. And I think, uh, I really do think it's going to make for a great video. Okay, so congrats to, I'm going to say it, the August Monster Bass box, the best box I've ever seen in my life sent out as a, uh, as a subscription unbelievable thumbs up monster bass you crushed it this month that is unbelievable so saturday mornings the show's on six to nine you can listen to us on uh, on iheart radio that's where we're, we're on clear channel on iheart on the iheart app or you can watch us directly on the, on youtube we go direct we we put up the stuff and and put it uh put it on youtube later make sure you subscribe to the youtube channel we're like a hundred away from giving away the sunglasses and to your choice i'm not just going to send you a pair that i didn't like we're going to you're going to get to pick whatever pair whatever lens whatever frame it's yours and that's like a 269 279 dollar value so you got to subscribe because it's only going to be a subscription. You'll see me put a video up saying, hey, we got to 3,000. You guys need to send a comment. So you'll have to comment on that video. So I thank everyone for watching. Hopefully I've answered as many questions as I could. I don't know what else you guys want to know about me. One of these days I'm going to get Mike on here with me at the same time. Oh, I'd like to go feed deer. Yeah. Um, I'll get Mike on here and we'll try to do one of these uh together because it doesn't make sense we've got a lot of amazing things coming up um in the in the future and in the distant future there are some absolutely stupid things that you're going to be absolutely amazed by we're trying to step it up and uh it starts with the youtube channel and, it, and really it starts with y'all if we've never said thank you thank you for being part of the family we try to make sure we say thank you and then show you our thank you by giving you the prize packs. So if you want a prize pack, you know how to do it. Autism Anglers, I'd like to see you. Good evening. Anything I, we can ever do for you guys, you guys need to ask. Okay, guys, make sure you subscribe. Click the like button on YouTube. Uh, click that notification button so you know when we're going on. And make sure you take a kid fishing and to get your fish on. Hey, Brian. One of these days, I'll just do a question and answer. Because any questions you ever had about anglers and all that stuff, maybe I'll answer them. There you go, Jason. Thank you. Guys, thank you. Monster Bass. 2 thumbs. Who's got two thumbs and thinks Monster Bass killed it this, this month? This guy. Anyway, take kid fishing. Get your fish on. Thanks for everything, guys. We'll see you soon. Later.